The Trident in Minecraft is a very unique weapon, a little rare to run into every single Minecraft playthrough, but when you do get your hands on it, it is a blast to use. But what if it was our only weapon we could use? Would that make the game easier or harder? Let's find out in this video. What's up? What's poppin' everyone? Alright, we're here. Minecraft. Trident only. We're spawning in the Trident because... It's can I beat Minecraft with a trident? Not can I find a trident? Uh, we're also, I also have a data pack I'm gonna use that makes it so when you throw the trident into the void, you keep it because I don't know why that isn't an option already. Or I don't know why loyalty three doesn't make it so you keep it. Trident saver. It says incompatible. That's a lie. I tested it. It's compatible. Let's call it trident world. Now, this isn't a speed run. This is, this is just straight up. Well, I wouldn't say it's like a regular Minecraft run either but i'm not trying to speed run it i'm gonna take my time we're gonna get what we need to get what the fuck is this world no we gotta do new world <laughs> tridents have stanky durability do they what does that mean what's stanky mean oh, is that a good thing so the thing about tridents they actually hit hard as shit so you wouldn't think it's a challenge the thing is i went into a, a test world to test like fighting the ender dragon with a trident and that shit was kind of hard like unless the the dragon's on the ground obviously it's gonna be really hard to hit it with a projectile that isn't a bow good luck trying to get loyalty oh that's something else we gotta think about I, no we'll get loyalty we'll just do the villager shit i don't think i'm a random enchant my trident i don't think that would be smart to do dude why do you guys keep on asking if i have hacks on like what, what do you want me to say yes yes i'm playing with fucking notice client all right goal number one when playing minecraft you guys want to list goal number one for me what's you usually what's your guys's first goal when playing minecraft my goal i like to get a good color bed and a nice house that way all the minecraft bitches will flock to me <laughs> But that's just my first goal. Can I jump and land on the bed? Do you guys think I'm fast enough for that? Or is that is that death? How about I do it like not that far down? How about I do it to like right here? Not bad, right? <laughs> is that 24 blocks? Can I survive this? <laughs> didn't work out that time <laughs> look at that dumbass he walked into the lava my streamer sucks what do you mean i hit i hit it before i didn't hit the second one but i hit the first one are you like smashing your mouse with your fists no this is what i was doing but it was on the desk so it sounded louder you know how noise works if it's just a trident why you got a pickaxe steak cobble this dude listed every item in my inventory why, why do you think i have all these other items bro you want me to name the stream can i beat minecraft with just a trident and a pickaxe and some food and some blocks like bro come on you're being too like you want that shit to be like specifically the title and everything <laughs> being a fucking party pooper head ass it's so beautiful but damn look at my fucking forehead Fuck. That motherfucker on swole mode. Gotta go. <laughs> that motherfucker on swole mode. Gotta go. I don't know what chunks. Like, what, what am I playing on here? Render distance 14. Let's play on 48. Imagine not being able to play on 48 chunks. Feels a little framey. I have a feeling. Oh, hello. Speed run. We're going to the nether. Oh, look. This is Damn, the black horses, though. Racist Minecraft. You guys think they allow white horses to roll with them? You smell a village to my left? Yeah, I was feeling this direction, too. I was just talking about this on my Discord. But I think, like, Mojang, they might have a problem with future development in terms of them, like, having a set of rules that they have to follow to develop. You know what I'm saying? Instead of just, like, adding things to the game that make it more fun, they're, like, following a certain set of rules. And because they have to follow the search center rules they can't add in things that would just outright be fun if they added it in like they said they won't add in things that break blocks because they don't want something that breaks blocks unless it's the player's fault which means they won't add in natural disasters and i don't know if you guys have ever played with a natural disaster mod but that shit is fun <laughs> even if you are a builder that shit is fun when a fucking tornado just sweeps you and your boys off your feet a fucking tsunami just wipes out your town like that shit be kind of fun though but then it's weird like i don't know if you guys watched the uh the recent minecon shit most of you had to watch the recent minecon stuff because it was the caves and cliffs thing but like jeb himself he said he had a fucking book with like rules in it and like so many of those rules are so stupid it's just like bro just work on making the game fun for all your player base to just play the motherfucker got the goddamn bible of minecraft rules and they had to fucking follow it they got the holy commandments of minecraft rules like bro just develop the game make it fun for all your players it's not that serious don't get me wrong though i still love like i still love minecraft i still think they are one of the best like development teams to update their game their updates are really good but 
but like some of the decisions they make is so so weird but we all know the best thing that came out of minecraft from these uh, recent years is uh steve being in smash i think steve being in smash is better than the cave update as fucking as amazing as the cave update is steve in smash that shit is like that's a once in a lifetime thing right there you're not seeing that shit ever again bro where the hell are the villagers at look at the fox hey what do you say what do you say Oh, that's what they say. Okay. The fucking important question. I had to know. Don't tell me it's an abandoned village. Are you fucking kidding me? Okay, it's not. I thought it was an abandoned dead village. Ah, there you go. That's the lovely noise I was waiting for. What's up, sir? Yeah, that's right. Keep that door closed. He knew what to do. This is a cool village. It's like on the side of a mountain. Clay. Perfect thing to trade with villagers. Boom. That's how we're going to get our emeralds is clay. How far do you think a baby villager would go if you punted it like a football? Pretty damn far. I think the heaviest part of a villager is definitely the nose. So as long as you get like a good kick, maybe directly on the nose because it has like the most surface area, you probably get a good kick out of that. You don't need to be a good kicker either. Duck! I ducked under it in real life, but my character didn't. I tried to, though. You guys saw it. You saw the vision. What do you guys think they're going to add, like, sex with the village? <laughs> When's that update coming up? How efficient would a gun be on the dragon? It'd be pretty damn efficient. Bane of Arthropods! You've never... Oh, loyalty one? Do I get loyalty one and just upgrade it? How much would that be? That would be 36 emeralds for two loyalty twos. Yeah, it's not bad. Because we'd probably end up getting around or having to pay 30 emeralds. There's people that would pay to feel on them toes. <laughs> he just like me. He just like me. For real. I can suck on my homie's balls without being gay. What the fuck are you talking about? Nobody's even like mentioned that. You got something to say, bro? We're talking about Manny Petty. This dude said, I can suck on my friend's balls. Like what? Nobody was even talking about that. <laughs> Dude went on a whole side tangent. That dude, he had some shit he wanted to get out. Who said that? Fruit snacks? Fruit snacks had some shit he wanted to get out. Hey, we won't judge here. You want to suck in your boy, your homie's balls? Go ahead. As long as they're consenting, all right? He just like me. For real. Is there a thing in 1.17 about like finding diamonds by using clay? Or did they change that? Because then they change diamond generation again because i know a regular 1.17 diamonds are hard to find but 1.17.1 i think they made them like back to normal or some shit hey, hey what's up bro damn who the fuck are you homeless get off of my shit <laughs> he's acting like there isn't a house open somewhere right there bro this house is open bro it's a liar liar ye pants be on fire what's the scariest thing ever in mc the fucking cave noises there's nothing scarier than cave noises and ravine creepers you guys know i'm talking about ravine creepers those are the worst you'd be vibing just entered a nice ravine boom creeper falls from the sky explodes it's like i feel like they don't even like hiss when they fall from the sky like their hissing noise is like covered by their damage and then next thing you know, you're just fucking dead. The next Minecraft stream we do, I'm going to set all my notification noises to creeper noises. That way you guys can like jump scare me throughout the stream. This dude said, Bree bra. Is that the fucking angry bird noise? Oh, what the fuck? This is a bad neighborhood, bro. I'm in Detroit. No, you changed your trade? Why did he change his trade? Name one black smash character, Ganon. Stop. Steve Enderman. Exactly. There's the Black Steve skin. Or the Black Alex skin, I guess. Is there a Black Steve one? Impaling. Impaling is ass because it's only aquatic creatures. Mojang has implied that sex with villagers won't be possible. Like, I read that in, like, a fucking top five voice. It's more expensive, you fucking dickhead. You big nose head ass. Mm. You know, I'll punch him in his big ass nose. This is way more expensive. Mm. Compared to like the size of his body, his nose I would actually consider like normal size. What's harder, me or bedrock? See like this right here, If I do I have to dig down to the middle? Or I thought it was like the edge one and then you dig down a little bit, like I don't remember. I doubt it's the middle, there's no way. I don't know, when I watched the video about the diamonds and clay shit, like the dude had like a whole like mathematical equation he was using. And I kind of just like lost interest once I saw that part. I was like, I'm not going to use math to find diamonds. I'll just find them how I usually find them. I'm not seeing any diamonds. I'm already down here. Oh, oh, look at that. It wasn't Y11, but we did find them. 
Is it really just as easy as going in the middle? That's so like, that's like finesse right there, bro. That really is finessing. Cause I feel like that's so easy. Like Mojang would never let have something like that, you know? No way. Oh, it was in the middle, but like maybe it's just like in the vicinity. It was the block. What is that? South. The first block south. I think, yeah, I heard that too. Like first block south works. You're supposed to go like seven north and make sure you don't hit a chunk border. I think you got lucky. Huh. Ha, ha. Or back to the swamp. And then we're going to put this theory to the test, okay? We're going to try both. We had one person saying seven blocks to the north. But make sure you're not in a chunk border. And then we're going to try our method. We have le the vibing leaf method. And then who's the other guy? And the Steptimus heap method. Leaf versus heap method. I'm not seeing I don't see any diamonds. Okay, we're going to try. We're going to try the 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 leaf vibing leaf method now we tried the heap no luck we tried the leaf now what are we at nine <gasps> i don't know septimus i don't know bro i feel like the the leaf method the leaf method might be hidden there's no way we're lucky twice in a row right let's make it break it right here and then if we oh my god beautiful kill golem why would he do? Why would I murder the iron golem? He hasn't done anything. Oh shit. What I do? This is your fault if I die. I started a beef. We had no beef and then you made me do it. Beautiful. Now we can do this. I feel like Thor. I feel like fucking Thor. Thor with a fork. That's so badass. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so good at aiming too. I should give it a cooler name. Instead of Trident 2, I should give it like like Mjolnir. You know, something like that. But obviously not the same. You don't want to copy Mjolnir. Oh, perfect. He's a damn pro. Minecraft pro team. Here I come. Why is the Trident name Trident 2? Because it's Trident 2. There's not much to it, bro. Because we lost the first one. No, it's just Trident 2. I upgraded it. It's no longer just Trident 1. It's just tr it's Trident 2. I upgraded the Trident to be better. This dude would rather kill himself. Just to get a taste of me. There's a creeper. Oh, thank you. God is ass. He did not expect these. Ah! That's fucking hilarious. It happened all so quickly. How do you have a trident and no diamond armor? What do you mean? It's can I beat Minecraft with a trident? Not can I find a trident before I find diamond armor or whatever you're trying to look for here. All right, let's head to the nether. If we take way too long to find the fucking portal, I'm gonna slash or find the stronghold. Nope, that's not what it's called. What's it called? Nether rune? Something like that. Nether fortress? I'm gonna slash locate it. I'm gonna smell gold. <laughs> hey, fuck you. What? I didn't hit that. What? I didn't hit that one? Who? Oh, well, there goes my trident. Come on, come back. Come back. Come back, Mjolnir. Ow. It's like the fireball came back with my fucking trident. Oh, shit. I forgot I'm not wearing boots. We can be homies. Look, I'm wearing boots. Where'd he go? Where was the dude we were looking for? Where'd he go? Damn, bro. Why are you getting so close? <laughs> I can smell his breath. What were y'all looking for? Somebody was not wearing gold somewhere, I think. You guys gotta go find him. Hey, what the fuck do you want? What a fucking cheater. What do you mean? How do you think I got this trident? The lords dropped me this trident, trident from above. And then the lord whispered the coordinates into my ear. Ah! <gasps> I found one. I didn't even need to use fucking... Slash look at I found one. I made it a terrible fortune. Oh shit. Oh shit. Y'all like the moves. You saw the moves right there. Ah! Okay, no moves that time. They got beef. Yeah. <gasps> Don't knock them off. Oh, okay.
the trident is pretty fun to use i'm not gonna lie <laughs> this uh playthrough is changing my trident opinion being able to do that is really nice you just need loyalty and probably a data pack so you know you don't throw it into the void every now and then i could do stuff like that like come on you can't do that with a sword innovation at its finest Let's see how far we get though this before it's like out of render distance. Well, I guess since I can see all the way over there. We just. Oh, I feel like Thor after that shit. Let me go to the end of that last stream. Let's watch how we died. Very funny way to die. You did not expect these. Ah! <laughs> That's fucking hilarious. What a, good, what a good fucking way to die. It was so, like, textbook comedy timing. He didn't expect these. <laughs> I didn't expect these, too. What the fuck? We're on normal, so I shouldn't have to worry about getting my ass beat. Oh my god. No, channeling is buns because it has to be raining. Not a viable enchantment. Don't kill me. <gasps> Alright, well, I guess we're not enchanting our armor. I'm not mad about dying. I'm mad about losing the fucking XP, dude. It's so boring to farm XP in Minecraft. Perfect. Hey, what the fuck? Oh my god, why is there so many baby zombies? Do baby zombies like spawn in hordes? Is there something new that happens? We're gonna, it's time to fight the dragon. I have all my stuff in my inventory. If I'm being honest, we're probably gonna need more eyes of ender because I always have terrible RNG when it comes to uh, the ender portals and I usually always need like 11, 11 to fucking 12 eyes. Like I thought it was a slim chance to get like the 12 eye one, but I get it all the time when I play. If this first one breaks, I swear to God. That would be pretty funny. I thought about that. Getting riptide and then just like going everywhere. Am I that close? Oh my God. None of them are breaking. RNG is looking fantastic. Beautiful. All right. Now here comes the next worst part. And that is uh, finding the actual part. The actual stronghold. The part that matters. The meat. <gasps> oh, look at that. I've been in these ravines too many times for it to be safe. I've died too many times in ravines for me to trust them. Oh, hold on. Let me see. Okay could be worse literally almost the worst possible all right let's do it let's do it nice i don't even have to wow i don't even have to like bridge to the fucking island bro nothing's worse than having to bridge to the island you know what i'm saying like if you played like during the og like ender dragon era like when it initially came out bro bridging to the ender dragon was fucking terrifying because like the old ender dragon legit would just like knock you off bro can you not walk in front of me fucking dickhead let's be careful i probably want to take care of these ones what is my streaming schedule none what the fuck is that i've never been hit off like that <laughs> A fucking dickhead right now. No, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> fucking poggers. Oh my god, he's a sniper. Is that gamer? Is that a fucking sniper? Okay, I got another idea here too. If he lets me get up here in peace, I'm gonna build myself a nice little area up here. Perfect, perfect. All right, I'm gonna play it safe to go down. I'm gonna just mine down. No need to water bucket. Okay. You wanted to you wanted to make it hard. I should get an ender pearl. Ah ah What's the safe way to do this? Like this, right? I have to be down a block. Alright, this is where like the just the long part happens. I think the hard part is done. That's always the hard part is uh the ender pearls or the the obelisk, whatever the fuck you want to call them. This is where the hard part is, and for obvious reasons. Oh, I almost hit him with that shit coming back down. The dude moves a lot. It's hard to hit him with the trident. And then on top of that, the trident does, like, no damage. Uh, 
that's where we get our damage right there that's gonna be our main source of damage the perch like always oh i was about to throw i thought he was going for a straight line right there what the fuck Am I critting? Does critting work on the dragon? I'm just assuming. Damn, he's a he fucking perching today. Speedrunner's jealous with my perching. Oh, we're making beautiful time right here. We're making beautiful time. Why am I acting like I'm speedrunning? We're close. I think it's only right that I kill him with a throw, right? What? That hit him in his fucking toes, bro. Go ahead. Take off. I dare you to take off. Take off. Oh my god, that shit was loud. Jump scare. Take off. Did I did I not turn this down? <laughs> it's like I turned it down, you got louder. Take off. Bro, I sound like I'm part of the Migos. Come on. The longest perch in history. Oh my god, what a throw. Right here? Okay, that was, <laughs> that was not the greatest of throws, I'll be honest. Alright, here goes. We did it. Minecraft, Trident only. Fucking beautiful. <laughs> Got a little close to my head there. Now do the wither. No, no, no. Minecraft speed runs, you know? They stop at the dragon. Are right, you ready? You want me to test this? Whoa. See, this should be a feature in regular Minecraft. I've noticed that every time you throw it into the void, though, it like misses you on the first like rebound. It comes back. So it's like, boom. You gotta go like this. What if I throw it into here? <laughs> okay, it's gone. It's gone. <laughs> what the fuck? That's how we lose our fucking trident. All right, it's good that we fucking beat the challenge, though. And that was Minecraft Trident only. Make sure you guys leave a like because I do plan to do some more Minecraft entry challenges on the channel. Also, leave some suggestions for challenges. They could be modded, data pack, vanilla, whatever you want them to be. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll see you all next time.